Hello everyone, I'm Chester44 and welcome to this Let's Play of Avernum 6. Last episode, we basically took a quick look up here, marched over into this old abandoned farm, and found the gifts again. And realized that this is actually where the gifts originally started in Avernum 1. Yeah, I completely forgot about that. That's where the gifts were. Huh. Or at least, yeah, it was just over this river. You couldn't really cross over here. This bridge was never here. Fort Monastery and Grindstone were never there. This area was completely giants, I think. Maybe. I don't know. Anyway, they gave us two quests. One to rescue spiders and giant lands, which we're not going to do for a while. And one to kill a slith shaman located northwest of Fermello, which we can do. And will do. But first, I just want to see the, uh... I just want to try and find... Wow, there are a lot of bats back here. We'll just take the crystals and leave. I just want to take a look at the bridge to the west here. I'm not going to cross it. I just want to see it. Yep, there's a slith. Alright, draw him back to us. Huh, he didn't come very far. Horde sentry. Yeah, I'm fine with killing these. There's another one over there. At least the slith can be killed. They're not that tough. I mean, they're tough, but we can still kill them. And there we go. Good. There they are. Alright, draw them back. That's a lot of slith. Alright, this could be a little tricky, but we'll do what we can. How about we just summon a minion to have some assistance? Why not? Assistance is always good to have. Caravan workers. So there's a caravan going on around here? Interesting. Alright. Probably won't do too much, but at least it's a little bit. Those guys are running. I don't like that. I do not like that at all. Alright. Can you kill that guy before he gets away? Damn it. He got away. Yeah, they're all retreating. I don't like that. There must be more guards up there. Yeah, they're all falling back, trying to gather together. There's probably someone strong in there. At least we're killing most of them. Oh wait, that guy was actually terrified. Alright, looks like that one's coming back. Good. Is actually still whole. They might have torn it down. Okay. Here's that slith. A couple arrows to finish off this one before it runs away. There we go. Now the bridge is still up, but I'm not going to cross it. That's as far west as I'm going to go right now. Oh. Horde Defender. Alright, let him come to us. There we go. At least we'll clear out a bunch of slip around here. I'm fine with that. Alright, come on. At least we're doing good for Avernum here, clearing out which slip we can here. I wanted that. And nothing of use in there. Oh boy! Draw those back. Oh! Horde Rune Bearer. That does not sound pleasant at all. Fires a beam of searing energy. Not 
quite what I wanted, but okay. It's gonna be tricky. If you can. I had a feeling that would be it. that would happen. Fires are freezing cold. Okay. Rune bears have other attacks that they do. Good to know. Finish him off. I said finish him off! Unaffected by the cold. Good. There we go. Now we just finish off these defenders. Oh, there's an underground passage over here. That's something we'll need to take a look at. Yeah, the arrows are fine. I do wonder who's under here. Well, we'll find out shortly. Ow. Please do not stab me. It's quite painful. I said please do not stab me. It is quite painful. There we go. Ooh, a level of Ortas. Energy potion. Alright, Ortas, what are we going to improve for you? Your Blade Master is nine, I didn't even realize. Your anatomy could do with an improvement. Uh yeah, sure. Improve your anatomy. That'll help do even more damage. Alright, energy elixir. Armor elixir. And some more beautiful crystals. Alright. What's down here, I wonder? Alright, let's take a peek down here. Oh! Slimes! Alright. I didn't want you to... We'll take that later. Alright, so we have slimes here. Fair enough. Well, we'll be fighting them one at a time. That's... Not a big deal at all. I'm perfectly fine with that. Can't see it. Can't see it. Alright. You know what? Don't even cast your spells. These things aren't that strong. We may need to cast a healing spell on occasion, but this is not that bad. Probably should cast a healing spell now, actually. Healing. There we go. Spitting goo mess. Well, at least these things are dying easily enough. They're not multiplying, and it's a narrow passage, so they're coming at us one at a time. This is fine. And... Oh, come on. Die now. Stop that. There we go. We got ruby and emerald and an invulnerable potion. That's pretty good. Ah, this is their trash heap. That's what they were keeping down here. Alright. Well, I'm not going to... There's a long, narrow bridge over the river here. Doesn't look like it has ever collapsed and had to be rebuilt. A rarity of here. This is the primary route between the western and eastern parts of northern Avernum. The Slith Horde uses it to quickly move supplies and troops back and forth. From here, you can see a huge Slith encampment around an Avernum fort. A lot of the supplies carried over this bridge are destined for there to keep the siege going. Really? Well, we killed a this caravan, so that'll actually... That should help out. They may be able to hold out in the uh, siege a bit longer. Alright. An indirect bit of help. Now. This narrow bridge looks like recent construction. It might even have been completed only a few months before the Slith Horde invaded. Its survival is unfortunate. If the Ivernites had destroyed it quickly, they might have been able to slow down the Horde invasion. Alas, Severnum had been arrogant and underestimated their foe. Now the bridge enables the Slith Horde to move supplies and troops quickly. There are several Slith Guards on the bridge, watching you warily. They suspect that you might have switched sides and are fighting for the Horde. That's why they haven't attacked yet. I can't see the other reason why Avernite soldiers might be this far behind the lines. Arrogance is not solely a human trait. Nope, now they're attacking. 
Alright, let them come to us and we will murder them. Ford Bridge Guards. Why aren't the others coming at us? Hmm. Interesting. Ow! That was painful. Okay, these guards might be a bit rougher than I thought. Uh, well, they're not too tough. I suppose we'll be able to be alright here. There goes that one. That should draw another one of them to us, I imagine, anyway. Yep, here he comes. Thank you, little rat. Ah, come on. Ow! I'd rather you didn't do that. That is quite painful, actually. Okay, fine. Charge in. Kill the guards on the bridge. Ow. Come on, let's finish this off. Thank you, little rat, by the way. And... Almost. There we go. All right, Northern Bridge is clear. Perfect. Let me just take a look down here to uncover that path. There we go. All right, so that entire passage up there has been cleared, and every passage to it has been cleared. I suppose we can try and see if we can see the Southern Bridge at least. Let's go down and take a look. Yeah, I'm going through this passage. It's less wandering around it. Plus, I suppose you can tell them about what we did here. It'll be good for them to know. No, no, I guess you can't really let them know. Oh well. No big deal. Let's see if we can what we can see of the southern bridge. Alright, so it's over in this direction. Hmm. Not much there. It's, that's the river. Oh! I can see the fort from here. Yeah, there's Fort Draco. Can't get to it from here because river in the way. And we can't really scout very much of it. Oh, hey, hold on. There we go. Okay, so Fort Draco is there. Bridge must be down over here. You are getting close to a river spanned by a large bridge. The Stone Arch survived the Horde's invasion of Avernum and is now a valuable asset for the Slytherakai. And that, alas, is why it is so well guarded. The cook fires of large bands of Slith warriors dot the east shore of the river. There are many of the creatures, camping, eating, and waiting impatiently for an enemy to show up. There is no way to pass through this region or cross the bridge without attracting the unwelcome attention of a lot of Slith warriors. Continuing in this direction is very dangerous. Well, that's why I'm going to stay way over here, far from them. That leads down to that forest in the south. That very hostile forest. Yeah, there's the bridge. We're not going to cross it. Stay away. <sighs> Alright, so... We pretty much explored everywhere over here, except for that forest to the south. Which I always still... I still want to explore to see if there's anything good in there, but... Eh. Alright, well... Let's take a quick trip back to Fort Dranlon, sell what stuff we have here. We can at least do that. Plus, we should probably tell the commander there that the person he was looking for is still alive. Well, not looking for, waiting for, you know what I mean. 
All right. In here. You. I have news. Uh, where were you stationed? You're roaming the land, then split up. We can't actually tell him. Why can't we tell him that Esme is still alive? That sucks. Fa. Alright. Just want to sell you all these things we have. And there we go. Load of coins. Fabulous. Now what the hell. Walk through and... Fully healed. Alright. Now we can go back up. Hmm. You know what? I really want to take a look down in this uh, forested area. I want to at least see what's going on down here. Slimes. Yeah, we can take a look down there, I suppose. I'm curious. I want to know what's going on down here. There's got to be something good out down here. Ow! I would have preferred if you hadn't gone for him. Quite a few slimes. Well, at least that one's dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, these guys are actually quite dangerous. I think you'll be fine. Yeah, they are surprisingly dangerous. Almost got that one dead. Almost got that one dead. That may have been a bad idea. Okay, he's barely alive. Almost got him. Another cast of that. Okay. That was surprisingly dangerous. This may not have been the best idea. Energetic herbs. There's the passageway down. At the very least, we can take a look at what's above. There's nothing there. Okay, looks like we actually killed the more, the more dangerous creatures that were down here. You know, the ones that were wandering. I take it back. And there's two of them, in fact. Even better. Alright. Let's do what we can to kill these forest shamblers. That was a nice hit. Yeah, they're not too bad. I mean, the disorienting spores are a bit of a problem, but still. We're killing them. Uh, them. Okay. There's more of those slimes. Goody. Just goody. I guess I kind of knew that you were going to come. Alright. Lightning spray, I suppose, will work. Alright. Divine fire. Disorienting spores did not affect us. There we go. There goes that one. Suppose you can cure him. There you are. Now we are once again surrounded. Yeah, I know, but... Mm. Actually, move a bit closer into a group heal. 
That'll work. And the lightning spray will finish off at least one of them. There we go. Really? Fine. That worked. Finish off this last slime. There we go. Hey, that wasn't too terrible. Oh, there's another. All right, charge in. There's, it's the only one. It's fine. Come on. Yeah, I'm doing a small distraction to kill whatever is down here because I want to see. I mean, sure, it would be nice to leave these, but I gotta see what's in here. You know me. I'm curious. I have to know these things. Okay, there's that passage down. We got some healing herbs here. And what's on the right side? More slimes. Alright, charge in. Go kill them. More are gonna come and show up. Surround our men. Attack them constantly. Alright, let's try a uh, fire blast. Seems pretty good. Yeah, battle discipline will work. Beautiful. And eh, what the hell? Divine fire. And then I'll do another fire blast. Fire blast again. Very nice. Ah, come on. Fine. Divine Fire will finish off those two. And an arrow might finish off that one. There we go. Beautiful. Gray mold. And that's the passage down there. Also, a couple random mushrooms. Alright. And I suppose you can take a look at what's down just to the east there as well. At least uncover the above ground part of it. See what we can see. This long gallery is misty, humid, and choked with vegetation. The smell of rotting vegetation is heavy in the air. A lot of heat is coming from somewhere nearby, encouraging lots of nice plant growth. There are no tracks or other signs that the Slytherin kind of come here. Something must be encouraging them to avoid the area. Well, I got a couple minutes left, so... Mandrake root. Handy. Ah, yes, these things. Tri-Budded Shambler? That's new. That can't be good. Ow. Oh, this one stuns instead of poisons. Please stop doing that. I said please stop doing that. I do not really approve. There we go. Oh! And it causes more guys to show up. I suppose it makes sense. I mean, it was budded, so... Yeah, that kind of makes sense. These things summon more. Because, of course, they do. Alright, you need to heal yourself. You're in trouble. Almost got that one dead. Oh, come on. You can die. There we go. Oh, oh, great. They spawn even more. Actually, no. Leave it be. Okay, this, this area is very dangerous. Right, uh, summon an ally. This is going to be a lot more dangerous down here than I thought. How about we get some healing in here? Yeah, that works. Okay, not who I wanted to target, but alright. Alright, lightning 
Pepperdine spray. That's going to summon two more once it's dead. That one is not. That's fine. Alright, and... Almost summon two more. If we can at least kill this one before that one is... Well, we're not gonna kill it. We're gonna do a fair bit of damage to it, at least. There's two more spawned. And that one's dead, at least. Now we just need to kill it. Kill these. Thankfully, the minion is helping a lot. Thank you very much, minion. You really are helping. Glad I use this spell more often now. I used to never use summoning spells or the like, or debuff spells, but I find them to be so much more useful now. Almost got this one. Almost. There goes that one. And there we go. Okay. This area is quite hostile. <coughs> and also slimes. Alright, let's kill him. Writhing Mass. I don't think these are the kind that spawn more. So I think we should be fine. Ah. Alright. Uh, Fire Blast. Yeah, that works. Not bad. Okay, you are very damaged. You... you are... you really need help. Really need help. Big healing for yourself. Thank you. An icy spray should be enough. Perfect. That's those dead. And that should be another pa- yep, that's another passage down. Well, that leads is the east side of this area. There's another tri-butted shambler here. We're gonna be in huge trouble. Yes. Wound the writhing mass. <coughs> It'll die from, uh... Rika's area attack. Which she shall cast right now. Perfect. Ooh, another attack. Excellent. Might die from this attack. Beautiful. And he is in trouble. But only one left. There we go. All right. Probably some more down here. I would not be surprised. Oh, is that a tri -butted? That's a tri -butted. I kind of want to stay away from that right now. Huh. And we regained energy. Random, but okay. Alright, I think we can take care of that if we just cast a couple spells. Also, summon a minion. Or two. Two minions would also be good. Alright, let's, uh, let's kill this. <coughs> oh, crap. I think... No, no, they might be able to get by. They might. Yep, they can get by. Good. All right, let's kill this thing as quickly as we can. There 
There we go. Hey, we got a level up from this. I'll take that. We may end up overwhelmed with our minions doing that, but we'll do what we can. Yeah, fine. Arrows, I'm fine with. No, not my minions! And here show up more of these. Now we've got loads. No, the minion! Do as much damage as you possibly can. If we can at least kill one of them, that'll be good. I think we will. Right. Fire blast. Yeah, one of them's dead. Good. And you're distracting that one. I'll take that. You need to give a big healing to uh, Michael. Not what I wanted. Well, the chair rack's definitely helping a lot. The wolf helped a bit. Could have helped more, but it's fine. Excellent! Fireball might actually kill that one. Well, maybe not kill, but... It didn't kill. But hey, that works. And one more. We got this. And there we go. Alright. That was not bad at all. Ah, uh, he died. And that's the last passage down. I suppose you can take a look underneath in the next episode. Oh wait, first level up for Anar. You have plenty of intelligence. More endurance would be nice. Hardiness and defense, actually, you need that. Yeem. No, get more endurance. Next level will improve your hardiness and defense. You do need it, but that'll be in the next level. So, next episode, we'll take a look what's exactly has been under these uh, forests, these hot, humid areas. Till then, I am Trusty44, that is Ortas, Michael, Amar, and Rika. This has been an Avernum 6 Let's Play, and I shall see you all next time.